After six months in office, Donald Trump's approval rating is the lowest of any American president since polling began. His popularity decreasing as the scandal over his team's possible collusion with Russia in an alleged bid to influence last year's election continues to grow. The federal investigation has now engulfed both his son, Donald Jr., and son-in-law, Jared Kushner. Trump hit back on Twitter, calling the probe a witch hunt and says he wants to remain focused on fulfilling his policy platform, like his campaign promise to reform the health care system. Internal party divisions among Republicans in Congress is hampering progress. A proposed, then twice revised bill failed to get the votes needed to pass the Senate. I'm certainly disappointed for seven years I've been hearing repeal and replace from Congress, and I've been hearing it loud and strong, and then when we finally get a chance to repeal and replace, they don't take advantage of it. So that's disappointing. The president has, however, signed a slew of executive orders. One of them, his much-touted Muslim travel ban. Both versions of the order were struck down by the courts, but it eventually came into partial effect, a decision taken by the Supreme Court, until it hears the full case in October. The ban drew mass protests across the country and was denounced by numerous world leaders, as was Trump's decision to pull the United States out of the Paris Climate Agreement. Wherever we live, wherever we are, we all share the same responsibility. Make our planet great again. The US head of state has also slashed the budget for the Environmental Protection Agency and rolled back regulation aimed at curbing pollution and emissions. On the world stage, Trump has ramped up tensions with China following North Korean missile tests and put himself at odds with Russia over Syria, going against his own advice to Barack Obama and launching a military strike. The president has stood firm by his pledge to put America first in international meetings and multinational deals notably by announcing the U.S. would renegotiate NAFTA and pulling out of the TPP. Despite the controversy that has dodged his nearly every move, continuing economic growth and job creation means support from his base remains undiminished.